But Bury, what's the best thing about EXP? I'd say the best thing about EXP, man, is the freedom. You can't put a price on freedom, all right? So I was just having a shit day the other day. So a bad day the other day. Um, so I tell it like it is, mate. Keep it real, for you. Keep it real. Well, let's tell it how it is then. Tell it how it I is. I was. I was having a shit day the other day. I just didn't feel like doing real estate. I was feeling down. I didn't feel like prospecting. And I went for a walk. And after my walk to clear my head, I went shopping. Bought some food. And I was just thinking, you know what? I couldn't do this in my old establishment. There's no way I'd be allowed to just go, fuck it. I'm having a shit day. I want to just stop for today and recharge. They would have said to me, you know, you're not uh, getting any praise. You're not making any calls. You're not doing your job. They'd probably fire me on the spot if I just, you know, walked away for the day just to recharge. But at EXP, we've got no bosses. So, I mean, you and I, Bjorn, we've got the most freedom, like the most free society and mentality within this business that I was just able to just shut off, go recharge myself, and later that day I ended up booking up two, two appraisals anyway. Well, Barry, I've been COVID last week, yeah? Yeah. So I had COVID last week, and I was in isolation for seven days. By the way, look where we are right now, today on a boat, by the way, <laughs> right? Just enjoying, it's a bit choppy out there, but we're still having fun in here in the bay. But EXP is freedom, like take, forget the money, forget the shares, forget the revenue share, forget real estate coming, forget all the bullshit, right? But forget it all. Last week I was sick with COVID. I sold four houses with a thanks to Rahil and Amol, who helped me close deals on those properties, and um, Callum as well. So I sold four properties, six new properties coming onto the market. Today we were meant to have a photo shoot. I was going to have a photo shoot at 9.30 in the morning. I was supposed to have a photo shoot at 9.30 in the morning. But it got cancelled because of COVID. And then I've got a virtual assistant in Candice. So I sent Candice an email. Candice, I need you to do this marketing, that, cross this off, tick this off. I need you to send these settlement statements. I need you to get these form ones organised through soon. Process these contracts. Thanks. Call me if you need me. And now look where I am. I'm on a boat eating balm in with my brother Buri <laughs> because EXP is freedom and earning twice as much money as I ever did. So for agents out there that think that it's, when we talk about EXP that we're spruiking it or all that bullshit, guys, seriously, man, I couldn't give a fuck if you join us or you don't join us. All I know is that Buri's life's better, Callum's life's better, Arahan's life's better, Chris's life's better, Mike's life's better, Simon's life's better, Bez's life's better, all right, Mr. and Mrs. Williams' life's better. David Washington's life's better. James Stacey's life's better. Bridget Connery's life's better. Raymond Pham's life's better. Amol Puni's life is better. And I know that Rahil's life is better. And I might have forgotten somebody. But all I know is that all these agents have got better lives and we've all got freedom. That's it, man. It's simple. It's very, very simple. Some of the top performing agents, you hear of them and they work like Josh Testelin. I take my hat off to him. He's the number one agent in the country. He said... He works 17 hour days, seven days a week. What the fuck would I want to be working seven days a week for, 17 hours for? Yes, you're gonna do $2 million GCI, right? But by the time you give it back to your company and the rest of it, what are you gonna earn? 1.5, 1.2, brilliant, that's fantastic. But to give away your fucking life, to sacrifice your life for that shit? Not for me, man. And the freedom comes, bro, because I, I can tell you now, when you earn 200 grand or you earn 500 grand or you earn 600 grand, life doesn't change much, right? It's not until you start earning millions of dollars that you start buying private jets and shit like that, okay? Mm. And I don't need that bullshit anyway, mate. When people are dying and starving in this world, I don't want to be fucking even contemplating a private jet, right? Just from the pure basis of all the fuel that it would suck just to even fly a private jet. So the ego, fuck the ego. The ego is gone. I'm not interested in that. I get to do stuff like this. And at EXP, you can be a two hundred thousand dollar agent earning one hundred and seventy five grand, and you can have freedom. Or you can be a hundred thousand dollar agent earning seventy five grand, which is the average wage, doing what ten sales a year, right? Versus forty grand at a franchise and not being able to do this stuff. 
So what you said about freedom, man, it hit the nail on the head. It's the only reason I've done this. Now, yeah, we've established good relationships and we've got a good group of agents that have come along from it. And I'm respectful and appreciative of all of them because we all get along well and there is a family brotherhood there. Now, what do you do? So I might have, on the revenue share, earned 40, 50 grand this year. I've given away probably about 80 by cutting agents in on deals that have been slow and quiet and they've been helping me by doing work. And even when I'm cutting in an agent 20% for doing some buyer follow-up and basic work, you know, it's maybe eight, 10 hours worth of work for a couple of grand, that helps them, but it also helps me as well. I think it's fairly generous and I'm still getting 80% of that commission. So it enables me the freedom to be able to do that sort of stuff as well, which means that I can be out in a boat more. Yeah. I can be playing golf more and I can be seeing my kids more and I can be seeing my family more. And don't think that there's not work happening. Like just because I'm on this boat, there's a whole heap of cogs turning in the background with social media, with automated digital, with lead launches, which is Bury's company. There's a whole heap of automated stuff going on, prospecting in 2022 style that enables me to be out here and do this and still have a business that runs. So freedom, Bury, you're right. It's yeah. all about freedom. So join us, don't join us. Do whatever you want. Go and waste $100,000 a year trying to set up your own company as Bjorn Kunzel Real Estate. When for 25 grand a year, EXP can do it all for you and they run all your trust accounting and they take care of all your administration. You don't have to worry about audits and things like that. So yeah, man, that's what it is. The freedom, man. The freedom, bro. 100% freedom, man. 100%.